We didn't even put a tune up in it, Kai. We did. We huh? had everything on by 0.9. I just ain't got enough. I really don't. I ain't mad at you when car just won't run. Kai, Kelly, and Lizzie Moosey seemed like a match made in heaven as they got close through Street Outlaws and ended up becoming inseparable. The reality show enthusiasts are rooting for the couple and think they're the end game. Both Kai and Lizzie are the champions in Street Outlaws and they're the masters of their trade, but falling in love with each other didn't make them any less competitive and after the recent episodes of the show, fans are wondering if the spark between the two has flamed out. So let's get into it and find out what really happened between Kai Kelly and Lizzie Moosey and whether the couple is drifting apart or not. Six miles in front of us? Yeah. You must have really good eye vision. Bro, yeah. you're dumb. He's so dumb. Kai and Lizzie have been together for quite a while now, and their chemistry on the reality show is pretty great. They're the picture-perfect couple, and despite being rivals in the race, they continue to take care of each other. Kai Kelly originates from Mississippi and has never really taken any professional training for car racing but has still become a sought-after driver in the world of racing. On the other hand, Lizzie Moosey is from New Jersey and she inherited a racing legacy from her father who was also kind of a big deal in the racing industry. Her family was quite well off and she had all the freedom in the world to follow her dreams. So, Lizzie decides to continue her father's legacy and become a professional car racer. She doesn't just do that though. In fact, Lizzie also has a knack for business and she's a very successful entrepreneur who does racing because it's her passion. She already was kind of a celebrity before she started appearing in Street Outlaws, but after the reality show, she became a household name. Although Kai wasn't very well known before the show, but now he has been loved ever since he appeared on Street Outlaws and has gotten involved with Lizzie. The duo isn't perfect when it comes to their relationship and they reportedly have an on and off relationship. In fact, their breakup rumors have made headlines more than once. This is mainly because when your love life is so public, even the slightest argument is turned into a breakup. But even after all the arguments and fights, they seem to be getting along really well because when Kai proposed to Lizzie, she couldn't resist saying yes and the couple actually got engaged in no time. Their fans were really happy to know that their favorite couple wasn't just getting along really well, but they also decided to spend their lives with each other and it also spiked the ratings of the reality show. Everything was going really good between the couple and they even announced their wedding date, but suddenly their relationship kind of hit a spat and the fans thought that they were never going to recover from it. They got into a very public argument and things seemed really ugly between Kai and Lizzie and in fact, Lizzie believed that she kind of made things worse, but a lot of people think that she didn't do anything wrong. So let's see what actually happened. Just when everyone thought that Kai and Lizzie are at a good place in their relationship and things couldn't be better between the two, they had a very public spat and the jaws actually dropped when Lizzie defeated Kai in a race. It all went down when the couple had to race against each other and this race was declared the battle of the household. In fact, Lizzie ended up reaching the finish line before Kai and she got the last lap for sure. This would never have become news if Kai would have accepted his defeat and just let things go gracefully. What he did instead was that he started talking to the press right after the race and ended up saying that he couldn't understand why Lizzie beat him and why she had to do it at this point in his career. Some fans pointed out that Lizzie only beat him because she could. They're not a couple in the racing tracks and Lizzie has every right to defeat him if she wants to. Kai playing victim in the scene actually backfired. He even went on saying that he needed the points that he would have gotten after winning the race. He didn't need the money, but he really needed to have those points. People went on criticizing him and saying that if he really wanted to win the race, he should have focused more on it instead of openly calling out his fiancée. 
Kai's statements didn't really sit well with the fans, and they called him out for being really selfish and that Lizzie was just being professional. Not only this, but Lizzie also spoke about the matter and said that she has read everything that people are saying about the matter and she's so flattered that people are on her side. She went on, saying that people have seen the emotion she's been experiencing and how hard it is to win a race against someone she genuinely loves. She also said that she has put her relationship at stake for this race and winning it was a really big deal for her. Lizzie seemed humbled by this win, but she also looked disturbed because of what Kai said about her. Fans think that Kai should have been more supportive and happier because his fiance won the race, but instead he decided to be petty. Kai also reportedly said that Lizzie only beat him to get an ego boost and it made a lot of headlines because Kai was displaying really bad sportsmanship. After these statements from the couple, it felt like their relationship was over for good. People thought that Kai and Lizzie were never gonna recover from this and that they've said far too many things about each other and that they can't possibly be with each other after this. However, it came as a surprise to a lot of people that they seemed pretty unbothered by this incident that stayed in the news for weeks. This whole drama went down on Street Outlaws and just when fans thought that they wouldn't be seeing the duo together, they went on to surprise us all once again. Kai soon went on to posting a photo of him and his fiance on Instagram and they were seen celebrating Thanksgiving like a regular family. He also posted another photo in which he playfully wrote that he has ruined the Carla Greens of Lizzie. It seems like there's no trouble in paradise after all. So it seems like the whole drama that went out on Street Outlaws was nothing more than an argument and the duo genuinely love each other. A lot of people thought that after this episode of Street Outlaws, the couple drifted apart, but they're still living their best lives and are happier than ever with each other. Not only this, but they got married last year in a very private event and looked really happy together. They also went on a honeymoon in Antigua recently and are having the time of their lives. It seems like the negativity and competitive behavior is only limited to the racing tracks and they seem quite smitten over each other for now. But fans do think that if they ever get into a face-off, things will elevate really quick and they won't be able to keep it civil. On the other hand, it seemed like the argument was kind of staged and a lot of people said the same thing. Their spat aired on Street Outlaws and it's a reality show, which might be why the alleged fight got bigger than it really was. People think that the reality show staged it all to spike their views and keep the audience hooked with some good old fashioned drama. Seems like the creators of the reality show are reading from the Keeping Up With The Kardashians manual. For now, Lizzie and Kai both are focusing on their racing career and are actually doing pretty well in it. They actually got so famous from the reality show that they've become a sensation in the world of racing now and it won't be long until the couple will be counted as the real deal in the racing world. And it truly doesn't seem like they'll be calling it quits anytime soon because their chemistry is pretty solid and they continue to support each other through thick and thin and that's all that matters after all.